Good morning. Pretty grey old day today. I'm at a very odd place in the farm. But I'm waiting for Jason. Um, I don't know if you can see down there. Oh, look, we've got the babies in the fields actually having a little holiday. Don't know if you can see down here, Jason emerging from the trees any minute now. And he is riding um, a young gelding called Fonzie. Coming, cantering up the track, hopefully going to stop by the time he gets to me. Here he comes. Now, Fonzie, I think, actually should have the name of Daddy Longlegs because, um, I don't know if you can see here, I'll try and get him in shot. Um, Jason has actually got really long legs, but um, Fonzie pretty much takes them all up and he's got a lot of growing to do as well, a lot of filling out. Um, he really does have very long legs, which is good because he's going to be jumping some very big fences when he grows up because he's... Uh, bread for eventing but I'll tell you more about that in a sec. Hi Jace. How are we doing everyone? Hope you're all well. Um, I don't know whether Penny's told you we've just finished the weekend and we've had a, um, a great spring camp. Has that been mentioned? No. Yeah so um, for those of you that are watching that were on the spring camp I hope the zigzagging is going well. <laughs> it's one of those fundamental things that um, I was telling them about is so helpful with young horses and negotiating spooky situations and all that sort of thing. But Fon's here, he could be called Daddy Longlegs, but he's a gentle giant, really. <clears throat> so far, he's been very amenable to just go along with whatever I'm asking him to do. So I'm sure he'll have a, he say at some point, but so far he's been just, um, yeah, a gentle giant. Anyway, I've got a new challenge for him today. We're gonna go up here, there's my, um, where I store a few bits of wood and a bit of extra bits for the farm. And most horses will have a look at that. And I've also got some steps and a little bit of road work to do. So let's go and have a look at that. Oh, right, we're off. Um, so I'm not sure if you've been up around this uh, end of the farm before. And we've got Julia coming back. Julia's a, a fellow Aussie. She's over here for the summer. She's just riding out on, <clears throat> on Romeo here. Morning. <laughs> so um, even for young Fonzie here, just passing horses and having to ride away from another horse is actually a really big test in itself without sort of napping and trying to come back. I hope Jason realizes that I'm having to run to keep up with him. <laughs> So Fonzie here has been with us for two weeks um, to be started under saddle. This is the beginning of his third week. So probably maybe his seventh ride ever. Um, so to come out round here, look at all these spooky things in the hedges waiting to pounce on him. And he doesn't look as if he's batting an eyelid. Hang on, Jace. <laughs> so a little bit about um, Fonzie here. He's actually quite a special horse because not only is he lovely, but he, he's by the sire called um, par uh, Party Trick. Let me get this right. I hope I'm gonna get this right. Apologies for eventing fans if I get it wrong. So he's by a stallion called Party Trick, which was Nick Gaulnett's um, young stallion, young event stallion, by Chilly Morning. Um, and he was doing brilliantly. He was a real up and coming event horse and sire, um, but was tragically killed in a road traffic accident. Um, I think only last year. So he has got horses on the ground, including Fonzie here. And I think there is some frozen semen still still left, but it's a, you know, it's a, a real shame for 
everyone involved with this chap's sire. Um, and for this sort of eventing community as well to, um, you know, for breeding purposes. Um, so I have actually only just found out that, that about this horse because I always look at the passports before we do the Tuesday check-in. So I can give you a bit of background info. Oh, just where we go up here. We've got all our chalk that got delivered. Oh, yum. Um, that's for a few more little projects that we've got on the go around the farm at the moment. Yeah, so Fonzie, I think has just turned four and as you can see, he has still got a lot of growing to do. But he's just been brilliant actually. All the time he's been here, he's been really calm on the yard. He's got a lovely temperament. You know, he moves really nicely as well. So I think um, Michael and Francesca are gonna have a lovely event horse on there. Oh, look at that. Slightly sliding down the steps. And he's trying to work it out. Oh, big step. Very brave. Are you going to come back up, Jace? So this is, I mean, yeah, he's only in his, this is probably his seventh ever ride. He's out around the farm, up and down steps, like an eventing pro. Good boy. Actually, if I were all like him, I probably would be out of business. I mean, <laughs> I mean yeah. but this, this is this is the the nature of the business. Sometimes you get some some horses that need a little bit more guidance, shall we say, and then you get fawns who you just oh, horses like fawns. You can sort of just point in a, a way you go, really. So, yeah, a bit more exploring to do, and um, we'll see how we go. I'm just going to go out here, circle around onto the road. There's a nice little. Um, We've made a little gap in the hedge to sneak through. You might, you might come and have a look at that. Or, um... Cool. Okay, we'll, we'll follow you. So this is Jason's sort of Aussie farming routes coming out. He likes to sort of make little trails around the farm and get going. So um, after all that really dry weather, We've had like torrential downpours. Oh look, little log to negotiate, um, which has made the made everything really wet. Oh my goodness, where is he going? <laughs> oh, Jason. Oh, off he goes. <laughs> Did, <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, right, we're out onto the lane. <laughs> so he did check that there wasn't anything coming first but um yeah so we've had lots of rain in the last few days luckily camp it was a three-day spring camp the first day everyone got soaked in the morning but then we dried out and it was really quite beautiful for the rest of the time we had 16 people on camp, they were brilliant. They all did really well. I'll just try and get in front so we can see Fonzie coming up the road. And so this is probably only his second time he's been on the lanes. And Jason will always look out for little places that he can stop and take the horse off the road stand quietly just so that if traffic does come they're used to um they're used to waiting okay back where we started sorry i'm really puffing <laughs> didn't quite expect to be running around quite so much but anyway yeah so um i, I can't be happier with fonds so i'm gonna go and do another loop uh, and probably just give him a little trot in the school. He's only been in the school um, once, maybe twice. So we'll do that and um, yeah. Good boy. Not another easy day at the office. <laughs> <laughs> what a star. 
So yeah, Michael and Francesca, you've got a lovely one here. And um, yeah, we can't wait to see to see how he um, how he goes in the future. All right, guys. Well, I might get back to my desk job now. Have my fitness for the day. Did actually go to the gym as well this morning. <laughs> Could have done without that. Um, but yeah, we'll we'll catch up with you next Tuesday with uh, a different horse on show, I'm sure. And uh, yeah, have a great morning. Oh, God, before you go, um, please do go on to our website, www.yourhorsemanship.com. We've just migrated onto a new site. It's really cool. New membership options. So if you like these little Tuesday check-ins, Jason actually has an online horse training resource that has over 250 professional videos, not just me wittering in the background. Um actual training videos following all his um, ground and ridden foundation programs and re-education um, videos and things like that but it's a it's a really great resource so do go and have a look at it there are monthly and annual memberships so even if you wanted just to check in for a month see what it's all about um, you can do so all right guys thanks lauren we like your chat yes <laughs> Chatting about horses, not hockey for once. All right. See you later, guys. Bye.